The following is a Miz War Games match. The rules of the match are as follows. Two teams will be contained in separate cages with one member of each team starting the match. At regular intervals, alternating members from each team will be released to enter the match. The team with the advantage will be the first to have a member released into the match. Once all competitors have entered, War Games officially begins. The match could be won by pinfall or submission. Exiting the cage will result in a forfeit. Now, let the War Games begin! The game has arrived. The cerebral assassin ready to engage in warfare. This is gonna be good. Introducing first from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, Triple H. You can see the supreme confidence in his eyes. Now here's the deal, he knows he has the advantage because he knows he has the superior team. Yeah, you're right about that, Cole. Oftentimes, beginning war games is a harrowing task, but this superstar looks ready for battle. Yeah, but even with the advantage, this is no easy task. Remember, he doesn't know the opponent's entry order, so he's got to be ready for anything. If you want peace, you must prepare for war. But peace is the furthest thing from his mind right now. And representing the NWO from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 280 pounds, Scott. Guys, perhaps no bigger challenge in WWE than what he's about to face. More than just the harsh confines of war games on his mind. And this superstar appears surprisingly calm, particularly when you know that in a matter of minutes, he'll be outnumbered. And also, who knows what the next member of the opposing team will bring into this ring. He needs to be able to use every inch of both rings, keep the distance, negate the numbers advantage, but we all know that's easier said than done. Superstars push each other. And the answer is always as far as it takes. If you're in a War Games match, that means you have asked for and received a license to do anything you want to your opponent. I fully expect these competitors to take advantage of that. Wow, that was a running knee a la Harley Race. Close line. What impact. To the gut, too. Big forearm. Scott Hall is really falling behind. You gotta wonder, what does this do to Hall's confidence? His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Oh, just turn that around. Triple H well scouted. What's coming next? Taking their time. The count is starting, and one team is about to have the odds in their favor. Big toss. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Oh, man, just punishing. Searching under the ring now. This can't be good. In a War Games match, when there's no escape, I have to think that cardio becomes a factor. Oh, yeah. War Games pushes your stamina to its absolute limit. 
There's no room inside that cage to pull up a chair and catch your breath. You've got to go all out from the moment you step foot in there. Oh, come on. You already had the advantage. You didn't need to bring that into the ring, too. And an inverted atomic drop. Taking the upper hand in a big way. Hall cannot be stopped right now. Look at the amount of members on each team now. This truly has the potential to become one-sided. Big double axe handle. Big clothesline. Setting up the table. He's done playing around. Total disregard as he deposits him onto the metal platform. Boom. <laughs> Charging toward the ring and looking to even things up. Ah, that's a running knee a la Harley Race. Intimidation. Part of what makes Triple H the cerebral assassin. This new entrant really has the potential to change the complexion of his world. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. He knows how to avoid contact. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Oh, man. Ooh, ooh. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be here all day. Power. I think you're right. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. Stop the cumulative damage here. Oh, here you go. Wow, Triple H got it. And the balance of power is about to shift with this coming entrance. for an ace up his sleeve now. He's made sure the odds are above and beyond his favor now. And Triple H has got it. Just one right after the other. Can't be stopped. Enters the ring and is diving head first into the chaos of this match. And some effective offense with that one. Hogan winning that exchange. Set him up. is in 
Crisis mode. He's lining him up. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. That's cross and unleash it. Uh-oh, counter. Driven. This was a back and forth match. It was very exciting to watch. Yeah, these two teams gave it everything they had and then some. But in the end, only one team could stand tall as the victor of War Games.